Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make the sticky menu. For example, if you uh, open a new website like this and you scroll down to the bottom of the page, uh, you are seeing this menu while scrolling the website and it's not disappearing. While on our new page like this one, if you scroll down, the menu will disappear and we left behind so to make this menu sticky just like this I will show you how to uh, do it using a plugin called my sticky menu okay uh, before starting the video uh, if you want to buy a web hosting or if you already uh, planning uh, making a website and you don't have uh, any web hosting then please follow the link uh, below this video uh, for purchasing the web hosting it is the best uh, web hosting cheap and reliable and it is also the best way to support our channel okay moving forward to our uh, sticky menu plugin so uh, this is our new page for which I'm gonna show you how to make this menu sticky for this purpose we will need a plugin called my sticky menu uh, log into your WP admin. I'm already logged in and this is the page Come to the plugin and add new On this page uh, in the search keyword type My sticky menu there is no space between And probably you will see the plugin uh, on the first position which is uh, created by Premio and there are 70,000 plus active installations for this plugin click on install now it will take a couple of seconds uh, because it's loading from the wordpress.org repository okay now uh, we have installed the plugin click activate to activate this plugin it will directly open the settings page for this plugin so you can use your menus ID or class uh, on that page and it will work I'll also show you some more settings for transparency and appearance after a couple of seconds when you scroll so please uh, watch this video till end okay now we are on the settings page here it will ask the class or ID of the menu so please come to the home page or the front end of your website right click on the menu click on inspect element it will probably uh, open on the right side like this let me show you both options so you can adjust it uh, later maybe it will open like this so you will have to click on these three dots and click on dock to bottom and after setting it uh, on the right place like this you will now have to again right click on this section the menu which you want to uh, make sticky right click and inspect okay here you can see the header and then all these children we will need this uh, header master because uh, you can see all these uh, selected areas are within this header tag so look for the ID it is masthead double click here right click this ID copy come to the admin section paste the ID here but as it is an ID so you will have to type a hash before this let me zoom it so you can see it clearly you can you will use this hash or if it's a class then you will have to use the dot here but uh, as it is the, the ID now you will use hash okay now come to the bottom of the page and save it
come to the front end close the inspect element and refresh the page now let's scroll the page and see what happens okay this is a beautiful effect but uh, when you install this plugin and set up it will not uh, as beautiful like this so let me reverse the settings first to the normal this will be zero when you install this plugin this will also be zero and this will be fade and this will be 90 Let me reshuffle the page. Okay, now you will understand what I meant for uh, the setting reverse. Now when, when you scroll down, it will just uh, fade in a little bit and will be transparent and no effect now click to the settings page and uh, first of all we will make the menu disappear uh, until it reaches the end of uh, this menu here so maybe the size of this menu or the height of this menu will be uh, 70 to 100 so first of all let's try 100 here make visible on scroll at home page on 100 and make visible on scroll at 100 here also save it and you will see the effect of appearance when we scroll the page up to 100 pixels from the top of the menu the page is refreshing and let's scroll the page You can see when it reaches the 100 px then the menu appears suddenly let's make some beautiful effect uh, turning from fade to slide and uh, a little bit transparency maybe up to 70 and if you want to change the sticky background color uh, then click here and change the color the transition time will be one and we change the fade to slide and now save the changes come to the front end refresh the page and we are done now scroll the page and see the beautiful effect for the transparent menu and it's also sticky even if you reach to the bottom of the page you can see the menu easily so that was all for today's video please uh, like this video and uh, share it with your friends if you if you know uh, anyone need this and please subscribe to our channel so you can uh, watch our latest videos thank you